Hey guys, what up? This is me, uh, Alif, and today's tutorial is how to do the flickering light effect on a building using Vegas Effect software. So without any further ado, let's start with the tutorial. So here I have a Marina Bay video clip uh, in 4K that I shot last year. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna make a new composition shot, which is our main com. And I'm gonna name it real quick. And then I'm gonna make the duration last about five seconds because the video is only like uh, six seconds. And I'm gonna make it in full HD. Press OK to make our comp. And once we've done that, just simply drag and drop our video into the timeline. As you can see, it's quite big in size. That's because in 4K. So we wanna match it with our full HD comp and reduce the size to 50%. All right, once we've done that, you want to create a new layer point we're going to rename this point real quick to our uh, tracking data all right so basically what we're going to do we're going to motion track the building and so that we can place the lights on the building all right so now you want to go click the marina bay uh video layer here press more here to show more um buttons on the below the track and you want to press this plus icon on the track to uh, show up the motion tracking control panel and then you basically want to select the type of tracker to double points so then you take your first point and then place it at the edge of this building over here and the second one I'll make it bigger a bit and place it over here if this one's too big in my opinion make it small nice right once you've done that press uh, track forward to start the motion tracking right uh, once vegas effect done motion track the building you want to uh, enable the rotation and scale as well and on the layer you want to paste it at the tracking data layer that we have created earlier press apply and then we can close the tracking panel to close it and now we want to basically take uh, do some masking a bit from the building so we want to basically take the light from the building itself and then paste it over here on this dark sport and then um, just motion track it with it and you can do the same thing on the uh, when the light goes off by taking out this dark part of this building and just paste it on the light sections. So I'm gonna do the light first. So I'm gonna make a new comb. Again, same settings, and I'm gonna name this comb as light. Press OK. And on this comb, we're gonna drag in the same video, the Marina Bay video. And uh, let's resize it real quick. And then you wanna basically add an effect called speed to freeze frame the video so we're gonna select put in the value of zero so that the video will freeze in timeline once we've done that you want to use this pen tool to mask out part of the building so in this case I'm gonna mask out this section over here just like that take your time to do some precise masking so that it will look good later and once you've done the masking, you want to go back to your main comp and then import the light comp into your uh, timeline. You can see the light appears. Now you can readjust it somewhere to cover up the dark area and you can also duplicate it and readjust it to the top to cover up the other section. Now. For the sake of the tutorial, I do it just really rough. You can take your time and take a better section from the building. I just say you're happy with the result. You just simply pad the tracking data. I um, mean the the comb with the tracking data that we have created earlier. As you can see now, it follow along the building. To do the flicker effect, all you have to do is just to cut off some of the lights, the layer itself. And so the tracking will basically happen. I mean, sorry, the um, flicker. 
like goes off and if you play back it goes off and you can make it on back just by duplicating the layer and then stretch it out cut it over here remove it so if we play it back So that's how you do the flicker effect in Vegas effect and if, if you have any question related you can leave it down in the comment section and I'll try my best to help you guys. See ya.